Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I want to show you how you can go about creating tiny little videos or enhancing your photos uh, on your in your on your iPhone or on your iPad. Now, this feature I'm going to show you only works on an iOS uh, device such as an iPad or iPhone, and you have to shoot the photo in live uh, live view mode for it to work. So let me go about showing you. As you can see here, I've got this uh, this photo here. Now, as you can see at the top here, where it says live, it's been shot in live. I'm going to show you also by clicking and holding the the photo, and you can see it's moving because it was shot in live. Now, this is where you can find those other enhancements or or filters. Uh, so if I click on the live drop down arrow, it gives you this drop down. If I click on loop, you will see the uh, the the image that all that photo I took is now looping. Now what this has done is it's actually created a video for you. So I can go about sharing this um, online. So I'm going to go and click on the share button and share to my Facebook page as a feed. And as you can see there, there's a little video. So I'm going to click on that and it'll play. Now it's a very short video. It's a really tiny video. It's very short. It's like only one second. You can also, if you wish, uh, you can um, download it to your Mac via uh, AirDrop. So I'm going to do on the AirDrop. I'm going to click on my Mac. And now it's downloaded over here. I'm going to print across here. Double click on this. And I'm going to play it. And there it is there. Like I said, it's only one second long. Now the other feature on here, or other in, um, filter, is a bounce feature. As you can see, it's now doing the bounce back and forth. So I'm going to zoom in a bit more. Back, forth. Again, you can again share this uh, on your social media or upload it to your Mac uh, via AirDrop. Now the other little enhancement I want to show you is long exposure. Now I'm going to make it a long exposure. There we go. It's now converted that live photo into a long exposure. Let me go back to live. There we go. And now I'm going to make this into a long exposure. And there we go. It's now made the photo into a long exposure photo. And again, you can save it by uh, uh, clicking on the share button and using either share to your social media or you can um, send it to your desktop via uh, airdrop so that's it guys i hope you got something out of that please don't forget to comment below let me know what your thoughts i will always do my best to answer all of the comments if you're new to my channel please hit the bell icon and subscribe and if you like this video and you know, give it a thumbs up it'll certainly help on the platform and thanks for watching